we hope to even go beyond the steps and actions taken by the previous House to ensure that we find a lasting resolution to the ever-lingering crisis. We are not unmindful of the many sacrifices resident doctors have continued to make in the health sector, in spite of the many challenges we face and the poor working conditions within which you work. While many of your colleagues have left the shores of our country in pursuit of better working conditions, you have chosen to remain behind in service to the fatherland. We commend you for this and assure you that we would deploy every legislative instrument available to us to ensure that you are fully compensated and rewarded for this act of patriotism. I encourage you to take advantage of this meeting to bear your minds on the issues at stake and suggest realistic solutions to them. We must approach these issues with an open mind and guided by the fact that revenues available to the government may not fully meet our demands. Therefore, we must find a middle ground that satisfies everyone without prejudice to the 2023 Memorandum of Understanding. We particularly note that your demands include the payment of 2023 Medical Residency Training Fund, upward review of consolidated medical salary structure, CONMES, and salary arrears dating back to 2015. <coughs> These issues and more can be resolved without embarking on an industrial action. 